UFC 281 geldi çattı. Hadi dövüş dünyasından popüler isimlerin İsrail Adesanya Alex Pereira işleşmesine dair tahminlerine gelin şöyle bir göz atalım. I'm going for Izzy. I mean I broke down those last two fights that he had with Alex Pereira. Uh, Pereira. And in the first fight I don't see how Alex won it. I thought, I thought Izzy won the fight. It was uh, some Chinese uh, promotion. Second fight Izzy was winning it until he just wasn't. Until he got knocked out. He was winning the fight. Hey, that's a tricky fight to pin down. If I was a betting man, I'd have to go with Adesanya. He'd have to. You know, I think he's the best defensive striker in the game. Uh, physically, it just makes perfect sense for him to fight that way, and he's a tricky guy to hit. But Pereira's huge, man. He's, he's a huge guy, and they've fought before, so they have they have some sort of understanding of each other's reach. The biggest the biggest factor and variable in this fight is going to be the small gloves. But the more information I get on Piera, who's a little bit of a mystery right now, but the more I get, the better it is for Piera. I didn't realize he was such a large man. I saw a side by side with him and uh, Dominic Reyes. Dominic is a very good size 205 pounder. I mean, uh, Piera dwarfed him. So I didn't know these things about Pierre. Everything I found out, uh, uh, find out about Pierre is a positive. Oh, I got, I, I still have Izzy, but honestly, that's a really interesting one too because I don't even know if Izzy's tried to wrestle anyone in any of his fights. And if I was gonna fight that dude, that's probably how I'd win. But I also know that like uh, in that fight that Israel got knocked out, I don't know how many people know this, but uh, from what I heard, he was winning that fight. You know, he got caught, you know, like that shit happens to everyone. So. Uh, I, I think Izzy is going to have the skills to win, uh, but I think it's definitely going to be a lot closer of a fight than a lot of Israel's other fights. <sighs> That's a tough one, but I think I think for this one, I'm going to go with the current champ. I think he's going to, you know, he's got a lot more mixed martial arts experience. Uh, I think he would have evolved enough as a fighter by now and like be technical enough, especially because before the skill set they were fighting in kickboxing, you got to stay a little more in each other's face and that favors the slugger. In MMA, you can stay back and point fight, and Israel's really, really good at doing that, so. Uh, I gotta think Pereira's gonna win. It's, you know, I, I have a hard time seeing um, wrestling come into play at all. And I mean, it's possible, but maybe. Uh, I think it's unlikely. And given that Pereira's already beaten twice in a striking contest. I think that would happen again. I am gonna go with Alexander Pereira just for the simple fact that he's beaten up twice before. I think he's just a little more diverse. So for that reason, I'm going Alexander Pereira, you know, by knockout. I think this is a great fight. I've talked to Izzy a couple of times and the guys that have been training with him and I think it's gonna be a very, very long night in the office for, for Pereira and I think you're gonna see a massive win from uh, Izzy and I can't wait for him to go out there and kick ass. So. Adesanya Pereira mücadelesine gelen tahminler işte bu şekilde. Siz de videoyu beğenip kimin kazanacağına dair yorumunuzu paylaşmayı sakın unutmayın.